You get past everything and you work up to the pitch. What are the most common objections as to why they don't say, yeah, let's go forward? What do they say? So initially, like when I ask them if they're married, you know, I like to, I just learned this. I always like to ask, like, are, are you and, you know, the wife on the same page in regards to this refinance? When do you ask that? Just because I'm married, right? So when I'm hearing you, I'm trying to hear with my consumer ear, right? Yeah. And so when do you ask that? Like, hey, so you and your wife, are you guys on the same page with this refinance? I only ask that, like, let's say when, if I feel like they're already objecting in regards to their wife, but typically in the initial conversation, like in the beginning when, like, I ask them if they're married, but also before I do the pitch, like let's say before I put them on hold and I price it out for them, I also ask them like, hey, are you and the wife like on the same page in regards to this refinance? That's when I would like generally ask. So so switch that pivot up, right? So instead of saying it in that way, because you could say so many things, like you could literally say a statement and your intent is solid, right? Mm -hmm. But the way it's perceived is different. You want to change the word tracking of that question and be more like, you know, just curious, you know, as I'm putting this together, I want to make sure I'm meeting your spouse's needs as well. And because she's yeah. not in our conversation, what do you think she's more focused on? Is it the month to month savings? Is it, you know, urgency? Is it fees? You know, do everything at once because she's not That's here awesome, and he'll tell you or she will tell you was your husband, right? Like, and they might be like, oh, he has no idea how to spell mortgage. And that's cool. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. Okay, cool. Right? Like, all right, you so you're the one. But they'll say like, yeah, they always talk about, you know, make sure the lowest cost or the lowest rate. It's like, good. The reason why I asked is because I'm happy you called us. Obviously, we have a reputation. We're big. And we have the ability to transfer the savings to you because our volume and presence is so large. You get it? Yeah, it makes sense. And plus, like, I feel like sometimes even asking that might cause myself creating objections correct yeah you create internal objections because what they answer then it affects you and how you present it